The last Soufriere volcano has been erupting for close to a week now, but the cleanup and struggles for evacuees will likely persist for months. The images are breathtaking. Eyes are drawn to the sky as ash billows high up. But the significant impacts are for those on the ground immersed in it, the people of St. Vincent. Volcanologist Paul Ashwell. The biggest issue with the ash is, you know, where do you put it? Um, it's not like snow. In the winter, we expect the snow to melt, but the ash will not melt. It's got to go somewhere. And it coats absolutely everything. And these images confirm it. Homes, vegetation covered in gray ash. Breathing it in can be dangerous, and it contaminates drinking water, making clean water a priority. So when will the eruption stop? It's, it's almost impossible to predict uh, when, this, um, when this eruption is going to finish. Um, it could last for uh, another few days. It's not going to be an eruption that lasts for weeks in terms of the explosive eruptions. But he says there's another more concerning scenario that the volcano could develop a lava dome, acting as a sort of cork, but not fully preventing future eruptions. A similar situation developed on the Caribbean island of Montserrat, where there was an initial eruption in 1995 with frequent activity after. An outcome no one wants as St. Vincent and the Caribbean await La Soufriere's next move. Ross Hall, Global News.